Mars sample returns have fallen into absolute chaos. But truthfully, it's been pretty chaotic the whole time. Let me explain. Originally, this was going to be a beautiful partnership between Europe and America, both contributing to a multi-prong effort. NASA would send Perseverance to take samples and a launch system to get the samples to orbit. Europe would send a fetch rover and a satellite that would kick the whole thing back to Earth. Unfortunately, that's where trouble began. ESA lost its launch vehicle when Russia... It was unprovoked. But this is what Russian President Vladimir Putin unleashed on Ukraine. Well, Russia did some stuff that didn't align with Europe's values. Since they lost their launch vehicle and didn't really have any of their options, that was going to push things back by years. All of this was bad enough, but to add insult to injury, the cost had ballooned on the American side, and Congress wasn't willing to pay $11 billion for what was supposed to be a $5 billion mission. So now the whole plan has been scrapped, and NASA is asking for ideas from the space industry as a whole. So we'll see what they come up with. Maybe SpaceX?